H-E-W. What's for supper? This. Damn. Looks like a pretty decent meal to me. But are you willing? Willing and able, baby. No, I mean willing to let me do it without these encumbering clunkers. G.W., you know I just can't. Those are my needs, no, Lita. What about what's best for me? If you were fulfilling my needs, then I wouldn't need this. Good God! So if you won't keep those legs on and satisfy my needs for once, then I'll have my old trusty friend here do it for you. Because quite frankly, GW, it's bigger, better, and it knows exactly what to do. I'm in hell. I am old enough to be your mother. Well, when I think about you, none of that matters. Well, it should. It goes against my Christian upbringing. <laughs> So does hanging out in these bars, but you seem to have taken to that just fine. Well, uh, I think I love you, Peggy Ingram. GW. I'm gonna kill you, GW! Taking away the only pleasure I have anymore. That's cause you don't need no substitute tallywhacker when you got the real deal right here, baby. Juanita Bartlett says you was having an affair with Peggy Ingram. Ugh. That dried up old prune? Hell, woman. Why would I be wanting to make wild, crazy monkey love with the most beautiful woman in Winters, Texas, right here and now if I was having an affair? You really think I'm beautiful? Oh, baby. The way you look right now, and with that brand new heart-shaped wax job you got going on down there, well, you got my engine burned so loud right now, I might just combust you into thin air if you don't do something about it. So come on. Let's get it on. I can't hold back no longer. <laughs> but what are we gonna do about them legs? How about we compromise? One on and one off. And you know, the sex wasn't even no good with no leader. Not like with you. She only let me take off one leg. What in the world is she so selfish? Oh, if she only knew how, how, how much more actual and inventive you are. Mm. Both legs off. Mm. Mm -mm. You start to turn me on, baby. Mm -hmm. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Welcome to the hen house. Bark, bark, bark. Cackle, cackle, cackle. And JD, what are you doing? Shut up! My... <laughs> I see you're leaving town. <laughs> Mm. Nigger, get out of my house. Oh, you don't scare me, bully man. You don't scare me at all. How about now, huh? Do I scare your big black ass now, huh? Well, do I? J.D., Shut that slapping trap of yours. I got plenty to deal with you about. Now, how you like it if I put a bullet right through that nappy head of yours, huh? And I get away with it, too, because you are trespassing on my property. J.D., Shut up! Shut the fuck up!